Just moments ago, Henrico police releasing this man's name. He is 31-year-old AJ Iselli. Online records reveal his past includes a rather lengthy criminal record, and police say he is wanted. He was wanted, which is why officers went to that West End home last night. Just hysterical screaming. Um, a woman, you know, basically screaming for her life. William Anderson describes witnessing a violent Thursday night. Our yard was considered a crime scene as well. Right next door. I've never seen anything like that before. Henrico police say they assisted Richmond officers with serving an arrest warrant on Strangford Court when they found the wanted man in the driveway. They say he ran inside and began stabbing a woman with a knife. I could hear them yelling, come out, come out, come out. Then he's holding her hostage. And then I heard, I thought I heard, he's got a gun. And immediately after that, there were two gunshots. Paramedics rushed the man to the hospital where he died. Police wanted him for a February carjacking in the city. I counted 19 police cars um, in the vicinity. A family relative says the suspect and victim were a former couple. Their three-year-old son witnessed it all. And the police were very good about that. They came out with him, carrying him, um, and then running to another police officer who held him. And police say the boy's mother suffered critical injuries, but is now stable. That's good. That's good. That's the most important thing. In a statement, Henrico Police Chief Humberto Cardinal offered his thoughts and prayers to all involved. He says initial details in this incident suggest the actions of the officers saved the life of the female victim being violently attacked. Had they not acted more swiftly, more lives may have been tragically lost. I mean, this would be a time that when a, a police shooting, I think that would be thoroughly justified, you know, um, to, to protect a life. Absolutely. Police say, the op police say the officer involved in this shooting is now placed on a paid administrative assignment per policy if you stay with us. Later at 6 o'clock, that neighbor will describe his last encounter with this suspect and his message to the victim who's recovering in the hospital tonight.